Morning, Ernest. Oh, hi, Miss St. Cloud. Uh, the sun rides high in its path across the heavens. Where is the red chaise lounge? Ernest, what I came down here for you is... You know, engineering your lifeguard stand is an important business. You have got to figure your angles just right. Of course, I won't always be fixing things around here. One day, I will be a full-fledged counselor. I have learned all the steps in the path of the brave. I have memorized the handbook. And I learned to kick a key sign language. If only they'd give a fella a chance. I'm sure they will, Ernest. Nuh-uh. But the real reason I'm here is to see if you've gotten all your shots. <laughs> shots? Yeah. Okay. How's that grandfather of yours nowadays? I haven't seen him around lately. Oh, he's out at his place. I worry about him sometimes. He's so old. But these woods are his home. Yeah, he's a wise man. <laughs> Doesn't believe in modern things like shots. <laughs> That's right. He lives by the old ways. In fact, he thinks I'm wasting time studying medicine. Shouldn't you uh, have a little more practice before you go around sticking needles in people? <laughs> <laughs> I've had lots of practice. If I keep doing it, I might even get good at it. <laughs> See ya. Cold, wet nose, color's good. No fever. <laughs> well, come on now, Ernest. You know this isn't going to hurt much. I can take it, Miss St. Cloud. Real men can take it, and I'm a real man. A man with a hearty smile, a stout back, with grit in his teeth and nails in his knuckles. A man who has never tasted quiche. Is that your smallest needle? I did it! I just the Lindbergh, baby! I am Joseph Mingala! Ah!